Hey everyone, welcome to Young Gardeners. Um, my son and daughter are in the house. Um, they were quietly playing games. We'll see how long that lasts, but I wanted to take this time to show you where I keep all our jars and lids. Um, well, not all the lids, but um, the rings, most of the lids are in the house. Um, and what else do I have in here? The dehydrator and a couple other things. So. This is kind of what we got going on so far. I have the dehydrator and then up here is a really large can water bath canner, a smaller water bath canner, some of the extra lids, rings, the new ones that I got from a gal uh, the other day, um, a Nesco uh, like roaster. Um, my turkey roasting pan, a couple other things, and then, of course, baskets of rings. These ones are a regular mouth. I have a wide mouth and then a bag I haven't sorted that I just got. And for now, those are just empty boxes. And then these, well, one, two, three, four. These are jelly jars. That's all I have right now. And then back behind it... These are all, <coughs> sorry, these are all pints. So I got tons of those. Um, and then we're gonna fill in a box here. So as we finish them in the house, I bring them out here clean and I put them in here upside down to help minimize the dust. Um, here are six really big jars. I haven't decided what I wanna do with those ones yet. And then this bottom shelf is mainly quartz. And that goes from all over there and that's too deep. So that's one, two, three, four, um, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. There's probably twelve boxes right in there. Um, and then in here's another set, but these boxes are all different sizes. And then we got some more of these really big ones. I think these are half gallons, if I remember right. And then I've got two boxes of these. So doing lots of prep work for summer even though it is january um <coughs> i still have a cough it's so annoying and that's all i have um so yeah there's lots and lots and lots of stuff in here and then if i even need more room i can spread it out some more because we don't need this stuff up here um i mainly wanted to put empty boxes up there so i'm kind of leaving that open so there's that. Hopefully that'll give you guys some ideas on good areas to store your jars. Um, most, yeah, actually all the jars in the house are completely full. If they're not full, they are in the fridge being consumed. I know we have a jar of pears open and the kids love those. Last... Mm, September, October, we got, oh gosh, I don't know, six boxes of peaches, six boxes of pears, and, um, <laughs> I think eight boxes of apples, so we went and made jams and jellies, and, I shouldn't say jams and jellies, I think we just made jam, um, oops, we just made jam. And then there is obviously the sliced peaches. And I did those in a variety of different syrups. So hopefully, well, maybe not hopefully. If we do those again this year, I will for sure show you how I did those. They are my favorite to do so far, the fruits. Uh, and when you do those, or when I do them, I do, like I was doing syrup at the same time that I was doing uh, just regular jarred fruit. So... There you have it. There's where we keep our jars. And I just had a huge jar haul today. So happy canning. Bye from all of us at Young Gardeners.